CK, I've been looking everywhere for you. Where have you been? I've been out, uh, just doing stuff. I thought I'd check in before I took off from Atlantic City. All right, here's what I got. All right, in the last year, there have been eight deaths behind locked doors. Four self-inflicted gunshots, two hangings, one asphyxiation, and one fiddleback spider bite. So, in other words, nothing that pertains to this case. Zip. But I did find out that Professor Rankin was on the same payroll plan as Martinelli. 200,000 from Caribbean imports. Huh. Well, both men were involved with Vixen. This was probably their fee. All right, if you find out anything on Caribbean imports, you give me a call. I'll be at the Atlantic Towers, OK? Yeah. Fuck. I'm glad I caught you before you left for the airport. Uh, you might want to consider changing your final destination. What do you mean? Leslie here has pulled off a hell of a journalistic coup, and he's handing it to you on a silver platter. Perry and I think you should be the one to interview Peter Massey before his execution. Massey? Every journalist in the world's been chasing that story for six months. How did, how did you land it? Gosh, beginner's luck, I guess. <laughs> the only condition is Massey insists that you stay with him every minute until he walks that final mile. Can you handle it? <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, but what about Atlantic City and the, and the conference? Well, it's your call, although Massey may back out if it's not you he's talking to. It'd be quite a plus for the planet, Clark. <laughs> Okay, absolutely. Let me just uh, make a phone call. One second. Uh, front desk, please. Yeah, I'd like to leave a message for Lois Lane when she checks in. This is her husband. Yeah, please tell her that I, I have to go to San Francisco on a story and I won't be able to make it. Right. Thank you. And thank you very much for this interview. Just mention me in passing when you're accepting your next Kurth Award. <laughs> Deal. All right. On my way. Yeah.